auctioneer is being accused of skipping out on paying his clients. Hidden Treasures Auction Barn in Willard has been at the center of recent complaints filed with various agencies. Francis Watson joins us with new details tonight. Francis. Yeah, Paul, Hidden Treasures Auction Barn has only been in business for a few years, but it already has an F rating with the Better Business Bureau. Many customers say the company owes them thousands of dollars for items sold at auction, including Rusty Bell. He says he just wants to finalize his late father's estate. It has been very frustrating. I just can't seem to get it, get through it. And I'm so stressed with the whole thing. It's just it's killing me. Rusty Bell says he thought consigning his late father's property to Hidden Treasures Auction Barn in Willard would be a good way to settle his estate. I am unable to finish the estate. Uh, everything is done except for the, the getting paid for the stuff he sold for us. So I cannot settle the estate and split it up amongst the rest of my family like it's supposed to be. Last week, the Better Business Bureau issued a warning. The agency is cautioning people from doing business with Hidden Treasures Auction Barn for failing to pay its customers and poor service. Because of that, the company has an F rating, the lowest on BBB scale. I do feel like I'm getting a little bit of a runaround. Um, he does seem like he's trying, but I need to be able to get this done and that's what I'm pushing for. Roger Rice, the owner of the business, declined to go on camera, but he did agree to an interview over the phone. I don't want someone thinking I'm cheating them. Like, I don't want to cheat nobody, and I will pay these people, but it just if they give me just a little bit of time. He tells us that he's working to get his business back on track. When you have two auctions back to back, it, like bad auctions, and it starts to get into people's money, and so then you've got to figure out a way to Pay, come up with that much more money to pay your consigners out. I, I don't want any hardship between me and him. I don't want anything bad against his business. I just want to be able to get what is rightfully ours. Now the BBB says the business has not responded to its letter about how it plans to address these issues. Rusty Bell also says he filed a complaint with the Missouri Attorney General's Office. Paul Maria, thank you, Francis.